Welcome to Storytime with Miss R. Today's story is George Paints His House by Scholastic Books. George is going to repaint his house. It's about time. His good friend Mary comes to help. But what color paint should they choose? George and Mary can't decide. Yellow, like the sun or the mimosa flowers they gather in the field by the armful. Yes, says the lizard, yellow is luminous and the most lovely of all colors. Red like poppy or geraniums or cherries picked in the spring. But of course, says the ladybug, red is joyful, a splendid color. Blue like cornflowers or the sky. Wonderful, sings the bluebird, blue is the color of dreams. Black or white? Black, says the bull. White, says the horse. Black and white, says the magpie. They go very well together. Or maybe orange, like apricots and oranges, and the tasty marmalade made from them. And like me, says Mary, Perhaps purple, like figs and irises and delicious grapes. Obviously, says the butterfly, it would be most original of you. Pink, do you think? Like the graceful flamingos George photographs in the summer. Or like the hydrangea that grows in the garden. I like pink, says Mary. Why not green, like the banks of the brook, where George and Mary fish under the willow tree? Green, 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 croaks the frog, like limeade. Limeade. After much discussion, George and Mary agree on green, and to celebrate, they throw a party. To thank everyone who helped, such good friends. The end. That was another story time with Miss R. This story is dedicated to Vinko. I hope you feel better soon. Bye.